nigga. That means fire, nigga. I'm on fire right now, fuck, nigga. I'm on fire, nigga. Nigga, I had the biggest comeback of 2018, nigga. Niggas up here talking about Tiger. Tiger? Tiger? Huh? Tiger had the biggest... Man, get the fuck out of here, nigga. I had the biggest comeback, nigga. Niggas thought it was over with for me, nigga. After that... Before we start the video, everybody like this video, comment on this video, get this video a thumbs up. We going all the way up, baby. Boom! <laughs> See you when you out, look, something for the fucking bit. I ain't with the suck shit. All the bad strippers got agree me with the government. Fuck whoever judge ya and trick whoever love ya. But don't expect the ring if you committed to the hustle. Yeah, rock, rock city shit. She ain't right like them old rap city skits. I got many chicks, blue and black penny kicks, strippers that. A hey, squad, shout out to everybody hit that notification button. Shout out to everybody smash the like on that video for the video been started. Hey man, if you're new to the channel, man, please hit that subscribe button. Once you do, you become a part of the gang. Tiger, Tiger, you talking about the nigga who got broken up by Kylie Jenner? Huh? Tiger, the nigga who just signed a $40 million deal for doing what? Yo, ladies and gentlemen, if y'all read the title, yes, Tiger just signed a $40 million deal with Columbia Records. Run through Sony Music. I know this shit is unbelievable. It's crazy, you know. But I'm saying in my head, I'm like, is the labels just doing this shit on purpose, right? Because they just gave Takashi 6 9 a $10 million deal to keep recording records talking about, yo, he's a rat. He's getting a lot of attention right now. Let's just get this nigga money. They did the same thing with Tiger. Like, when I read that shit, I'm like, what the fuck? Tiger? Tiger? Come on, nah. Nah, all seriousness, man. Respect to Tiger, yo. He, he got the money, you know what I'm saying? But Tiger is not no rapper who I would consider is really a top tier i'm not saying tiger don't have bangers yes tiger's a rapper yes he's only a rapper for like you know club singles like songs like do 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 yeah 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 woo, woo, woo. and he has that shit with kamaya and quavo that song is all right the only songs i really like by tiger is rack city uh ao with chris brown bro that that's really it i'm not trying to be over here trying to violate tiger yeah tight yo tiger uh, he's okay, you know, but, um, like I said, I was shocked when I, when I heard this nigga actually signed the deal, and I do know that Tiger, he's good friends with Chris Brown and DJ Cali. maybe the label saw son of him was like, yo, you had some good songs in 2018, so we just gonna give you a record deal, fuck what anybody gotta say, but 40 million dollars, though, like, Tiger, so it shouldn't be no excuses. Like, when I see this dude, Tiger, he shouldn't be in the TMZ news with no running Lamborghinis or no running cars or nothing like that. It's not it's not nothing wrong with doing that. But like I said, there should be no reason why he ain't paying his shit off, bro. You just got a $40 million deal, you know? And what I'm saying in my head is, like, this dude, right, he really only had about, like, three three good songs this year i'm not trying to take nothing if tiger has some good other good songs let me know in the comments please because i really haven't no, ha heard no shit from tiger ever since six months so i think the label just did that because yo tiger is currently active you know and a lot of people they even brought soldier boy into the comments shout out my nigga soldier yo soldier yo tiger just won by default though bro like the jail setback it sets you back a little bit. But a lot of people is confused too because Soldier also signed to E1, right? Like in in February, he signed to E1 when he had his song Hit My Line and New Drip, you know? So he actually signed a multi million dollar deal as well. And I know a lot of people uh, say cheese, they, they put up something talking about um, so, oh, Soldier's mad. He don't really got nothing to be mad about because if y'all look at if y'all look at it, actually, I'm gonna pull it up. Soldier Boy is technically still active on the E1 roster, right? It's just that right now he is doing probation, so this nigga could barely pick up a pencil, bro. Like, so, like I said, when people like start sleeping on Soldier and be like, oh, he, oh, Tiger just took him out. Tiger, Tiger didn't really take him out. Soldier got a multi million dollar deal. Soldier right now is currently worth 30 mil. So if you think about it, him and Tiger is almost similar. And I gotta say, man, I know I'm gonna get a lot of hates in the, in the comments. Soldier boy is technically more better than Tiger. Technically, lyrically, beats, you know, all kind of shit. Tiger is only good for them, them bop singles like, ah, 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 
kick out your dome. I just kicked out the chrome. I should get a get licked like I like he's good for that kind of shit. Soldier and I know a lot of people be sleeping on him. Like yo, he just made crank that and tell my swag gonna kiss me through the phone. This dude, if y'all really want lyrical capability of Soldier Boy, go listen to Whipping My Wrist. Go listen to Activist. You know what I'm saying? New Drip was alright. You know what I'm saying? He has a whole lot of fucking songs, but. The thing about him is that, you know, Soldier promo so much, you don't really get to see the music side. And, yeah, and if y'all look, this nigga drops an album about every fucking, like, like every fucking month. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, a lot of people been sleeping. And, yo, he did open the door for a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? And I told him that myself. I was like, nigga, you don't got nothing to be ashamed about, bro. Like, you already did what you had to do as a legend. But when it comes to... Like, him and niggas like Bow Wow, they gotta do shit, bro, to stay hot. And I keep telling people, y'all think Soldier Boy is dying off? Like, when y'all talking about, he ain't been in the media for a while, so he ain't popping. Watch this nigga come out with some get a gadget or some catchy song to catch you for about a good couple months. Bro, he does it all the time. Remember, he had the joint with Nicki Minaj, the yes, bitch, yes. Even though I'm not a fan of that song, I told that nigga personally, I was like, yo, bro, I don't like that shit. The, we made it with Drake. I'm not into that shit either, but he still comes back, right? Y'all try to count him out and be like, Soldier Boy's gone, he's not relevant, blah, blah, blah. This dude will always be around. Like I said, he is king of the internet. I got to give him that title. So, when I saw Say Cheese post that, I'm like, yo, he just signed a... a he just signed to a record label as well. You know, I think the media is just trying to count him out to get him mad. You know, he also has a movie coming out too called This Can't Be Real. So, like I said, you can't really count him out. So, when people posting that Tiger stuff, talking about, yo, Tiger just really took him over. Nigga, it's sort of similar. But Tiger right now, yes, he, he just signed his deal. So, congratulations to him. Hopefully, this nigga can have more than... Two, two hot songs, right? You got a lot of people backing you up. The label is going to give you a lot of good features right now. So you going, you could probably collab with the baby, Chris Brown, like you've been doing, DJ Cali. You know what I'm saying? So he has the potential right now. It should be no excuses why I'd be like, I don't have a hit record. Yeah, the label might hold his albums back. But when it comes to singles, which is the only thing that you really need to be popping, you know what I'm saying? There should be no excuse why Tiger can't say, oh, it's because the label's whole. No, bro, you had a whole a whole bunch of time. But like I said, congratulations to Tiger. And also, yo, let me know, man. Do y'all really think my bro Soldier Boy is out? I keep telling y'all, man, like, this nigga's gonna come back. I've seen a lot of people just DM me talk about, yo, your man is out. Bro, like I said, I wouldn't sleep on that nigga too much. But congratulations to Tiger, though, man. What do y'all think about this entire situation, man? Please put it in the comments below. Make sure I like, definitely subscribe. Also, before you leave out of here, man, please follow me on Instagram, bro. I appreciate everybody who's been following me on IG. I really appreciate it. Shout out to my talent agency. They really hooked my shit up, bro. But like I said, let's get it popping in the comments. It's your boy Soldier. I'm out this bitch. Gang.